Hey, good morning, guys. Yeah, Marquis Lloyd did not enter a plea today. He is going to take more time to review the charges against him before he does that. He is facing 14 charges. Two of them will be for first degree murder for his pregnant ex girlfriend and the Orlando police officer. And the judge was straightforward with him and said that his life is at stake here. He could face the death penalty. Now, inside the courtroom, Markeith Lloyd presented the judge with several pages of handwritten notes. The judge read them over and then gave them to the state attorneys. The judge explained Lloyd is invoking his right to see the entire indictment at least 24 hours before entering a plea. So Lloyd will get a copy and review that before he pleads guilty, not guilty, or no contest. Now, also this morning, the judge spent a lot of time encouraging Lloyd to not represent himself. And at one point, Lloyd got a little impatient. No, I have a lot more to talk about. At some point in time, if, if we can't talk to one another, then I may force you to have a lawyer so that questions can be answered. So Lloyd saying there he did not want to talk to the judge. Now, Shade Dixon's family was also in the courtroom today. They did not want to speak to the media. Now, we've just learned that a copy of the letter Markeith Lloyd handed to the judge has been made available. I'm going to head inside the courtroom and get that and bring you those details on social media as well as later this afternoon on WESH. Reporting live, Amanda Crawford, WESH 2 News.